Junior Achievement is a nonprofit organization that teaches young people in kindergarten through high school the basic tenets of work readiness, entrepreneurism, and financial literacy. Our core purpose is to inspire and prepare young people to succeed in a global economy. The Acadiana Business Hall of Fame selects three laureates who are inducted into the Acadiana Business Hall of Fame. We also select a business person of the year, a rising young business leader, um, Richard E. Baudouin Award recipient, which is kind of a friend of business, and we have added a small business of the year and a large business of the year. There is a selection process. We do have a committee that gets together. There are nominations from the community for the business person of the year. We look at someone who has been instrumental in shaping the economy, especially during the previous year. Uh, so for the rising young business leader, who is a younger version of that business person of the year. Uh, from South Plaquemines Parish, um, born and raised there. Uh, went to school in Marrero, actually graduated from high school in Marrero, and then I came to school in Lafayette and pursued a degree in advertising design from UL, the time USL. I, I didn't do any internships because um, I was actually um, a single parent back then, um, and I had a son, and I went worked my way through college with a young child, and I only had time to work, take care of my child, and go to college. So. I didn't really have the opportunity to do any internships, but I always loved the arts, and actually I thought that um, I was going to go into architecture, because it was the only profession that I really knew of that was creative. And I was in the architecture department, and the advertising design department had a show, and at the end of the school year, the first year I was in school, and they showed their work. And I went up there and saw what they were doing and understood that they were trying to really communicate and move people to take action and, you know, create a beautiful thing, beautiful designed posters and CDs and books and communication materials. And when I went there, I'll never forget the day I went because I saw everything and thought, this is the field I should be in. This is, this is the type of work that I should do. And so I changed majors and um, pursued advertising design. When we first started working together, um, I was the creative director at Davis Partners. Kathy was a senior art director. And Sarah, who is also a designer, was more in uh, charge of production and traffic management. And um, we just worked well together. We would never let one another down. If there was a big project, we'd stay together till it was finished. And um, because we have very differing personalities, um, I think that's what m made us work well together. Um, we left that agency and decided to go out on our own and we invited the controller to come with us. She, has, she was a CPA and thought that she would be a good person to have in business with us because she knew business better than we did. We were basically three designers um, and you know what they say about artists and business. So, we went out on our own. Um, actually, uh, we've been in business now 13 years, so in 1997, I think. I really appreciate the fact that Junior Achievement has an award like this because um, there are no other real business awards that are given out in our community um, that have this kind of impact. And I, I was just shocked at how many people, after um, the article ran and I had my picture in the paper and a little brief bio on myself and how many people wrote me cards and um, letters and emailed me and congratulated me for winning um, this award and, and it was really, really made me feel great. And more than that, they help bring attention to the business community and they help, um, I think, give other business owners something to aspire to and I really appreciate that the junior that Junior Achievement um, has this award and that they partner with um, Cox and with um, the Daily Advertiser and Capital One um, to actually host a lovely event. It was a lovely event and, um, and host the awards. Find something you love. Find something you love to do. I think too many people are worried about just making money. Um, I think they should be worried about finding what they love to do because that's going to sustain you a lot longer than just going into a field because you think you need to make money doing it.